Is this the way you discharge your responsibility? Can't you understand that dealing with people the way you do is the reason for this civil war around here? I've worked with these people. They have rights. What do you suggest? I suggest that you get a different job if you can't get the confidence of your employees, you bumble-witted idiot. Tom. Tom, this is wonderful what you're doing. And you'll never regret it. Let them fire you. As long as there's a breath in my body, you'll never go hungry. <laughs> Calling me names isn't the solution. I'd like nothing better than to get the confidence of my employees. But who can I talk to? Who represents enough of these people? Would you consider 400 enough? Yes, I would. There's our representative. Where are your 400 names? There's the catch. He wants the names. You see? My hands are tied. This isn't a trick, is it? Do I look like I'm lying to you? No, you don't. Oh, Mary, you can't. If there's a right way, this is it. We're not being fair to him. If we want him to trust us, we've got to trust him. Well, I'm against it. I'm taking a big chance, too, Joe. I, if this doesn't go, I lose you. All right, honey. Tom, have you got the list you picked up on the beach last night? Yes, I have. Give it to Mr. Allison, please. It's going to be terrible if you fool these two young people. You old fool. How dare you come into my office and talk to me like you did? I can outwit morons like you every day of the week and twice on Sundays, which is why I sit behind the desk while you stand in front of it. Why, you! Hoover, get that paper. 